Today we're going to present the first and probably the last segment of Cooking with Big Tim. Here's BT. <coughs> Thanks, Mitch. And welcome everybody to TelemarkTips.com World Headquarters Kitchen. Today we'll be sharing a recipe sent in by reader Dana Dorset. I'll be preparing roasted thermofit. First, let me show you the quick preparation process. We've made four toe spacers because I like to use them on both the big and little toe. We made the spacers out of folded paper wrapped with duct tape. And we made the toe caps by cutting a thick sock just in front of the metatarsals. Ooh, metatarsal, triple word score. With the toe spacers and toe cap in place, we put on the thinnest liner sock that we could find. We've preheated the oven to 325 degrees, but we're going to turn it down to warm now. Also, we've placed foil on the bottom rack to prevent any scorching by the hot elements. Place the liners on the center of the rack and bake till golden brown. <laughs> Actually, six to ten minutes should do the trick. And Dana says, if you smell stinking plastic, odds are they're ready. Check them every minute after five minutes to make sure you don't burn them. They're ready. Insert the liner into the shell. And if you have an orthotic or a custom footbed, now it's time to put it in. Cinch down the buckles just snug but not real tight. Remain standing during the cooling process. Some people like to lean on the cuff a bit to pack out a firmer tongue for better control. Others stand straight up for maximum shin cushioning. By the time your toes are completely roasted, the liner should have cooled off enough. This is about 12 to 15 minutes. Roasted to perfection. Roasted perfect. Roasted. <laughs> One, two, three. Roasted to perfection. <laughs> Are you chuckling at That should be pretty good. <laughs> hey Mitch, this apron make my butt look big? <laughs> Not too bad, Tim.